happy vlogmas day 14. Day 14. Maxie's having a hard day today. It's emotionally a hard day for you, for sure. I don't know about emotionally. It's just mentally, I'm, I don't know. I don't know what the hell it is, but I'm, I don't know. Definitely going through some shit. Anyway. We're opening up the box. Shout out Fukari. Uh, Maxie's also going to be doing a um, install video on Mad Maxi for them, but I'm just getting some behind the scenes footage of him. Look at it, looks badass. Look at the seat though, it's nice and cushy. Cushy, All right, you can go to... so we got two different kinds. There's this one, it's like a him and hers situation. This one's called the Libra. Oh, nice. This one might be yours. Really? <laughs> Listen how excited you got. <laughs> Merry Christmas to us. Merry Christmas to us. Merry early Christmas to us. <sighs> Thank you. I don't... Shout out, Bukhari. <laughs> this is so beautifully made, you guys. I wish you could all touch it. <laughs> Gosh, these zip ties are intense. It's not as heavy. Oh, it's heavy, yeah. <laughs> oh, dang, I could have used these for all the zip ties. Wow, they hook it up. I think that's what this is for. It is, for sure. <laughs> it's so nice. I'm gonna keep this tool forever. Zip tie cutter, what? Whoa! I probably wasn't supposed to clip that yet. Whatever. He's like wanting to use the tool now. Dang. 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 This is dope. All right. Sorry, I've just never had a zip tie cutter tool. It's best case. It's pretty cool. Anyway. I do like tools. Trying to touch everything as she goes by. Oh, oh. look at all that cool stuff. I'm gonna order some Christmas presents on Amazon. For who? Billy and you, your mom. So if you can, if you can refrain from going on the Amazon, are you done with the Amazon for this month? I don't want you to spend any more money on me. Really simple install here. You're just inserting it into the hole. And then you can literally just tighten it right here. If you want to tighten it up more on your own, you can uh, hit the Allen key in that slot. But that for now looks good. It's a really high seat height. Done and done. I'm gonna remove some more zip ties. I mean, really simple install. I mean, it wasn't difficult at all. Um, Look at this, you guys. Look at that passenger seat, though. It's ideal. It's got a lot of room for more. Uh, chocolate brown. It looks black. It's chocolate. All right. Let's take it for a little spin and see how it goes. I tightened everything up. So these evidently don't turn on the bike. What they do is they unlock the battery. So that's unlocked, and then this just comes out. So if you need to charge it and it's in your garage, you know, you just bring this inside and charge it. Wow. Or if you don't want anyone to steal your, well, someone can still steal your bike. Yeah, and buy another battery probably. So then you put this on like so. And that's on. Cool. So then you put the battery switch and then you hold this down and there it's calibrating or something. And that's that. <gasps> wow. 
Just like that. Holy shit, I nearly yeeted myself. Dom would be so stoked. I think this one might be mine. This just seems a little big for you. Oh, I can wheelie this for sure. <laughs> You barely turn the new line. <laughs> I'm glad we opened these today. What? This is gonna be so good for him. I just know it. I told him, go outside. Like when you haven't been. Hi! Did you have a good day at school? Anyway, I know this is gonna make him feel better. Being outside and playing with these two. <laughs> the excitement's over. Hi, Levi. Okay, what do I? Ooh. If you need to lower the seat, you can. Lower the seat. Here, get off. It's a nice little tail light on there. Hi, Billy. That's your mom. These bicycles are extremely dangerous uh, without a helmet. So definitely wear your helmet. Jane is loving it, I believe. <laughs> this is awesome. Yeah, I would imagine that's mine. It just seems to sit pretty tall. Here, take her. Probably my favorite thing about this is the padded rear seat here. Like it, it's just so comfy for someone to sit on. And it's got, it's got the dual rear shock so you know it can support some weight it's literally what it's for so some people can just chill on here take their friends on the beach wherever i could probably even ride it from back here honestly if i readjusted the handlebars that was too easy day 14. let's see is it gonna be a wider ride tc hopefully white all right, let's see if we get lucky. We did not get lucky. Of course the night I miss is white. The Perfect Match, it's a Merlot. That would be the name of it. From France. Wee oui, wee. Oui. It is not a twist off, so I'll pour this up for my sister and I. She's back. She's back for the wine tastings and turn you guys back on. A Merlot, 13%. What does this say? <laughs> I was gonna say hungry, but that was your throat. <laughs> I wonder if it caught it. <laughs> okay, I gave my sister a little less because she's driving home. <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, so good, so good. Oh, I have not got Billy. I have two weeks, but I have not, no, I have 10 days. I have not got Billy a first Christmas ornament. Mm. I need to. I just have that stock, or what do they call it? I always say stock. Uh, what's the bird that brings the baby? Stork. Stork. Mm -hmm. So my mom got me that stork last year. <laughs> <laughs> Her throat made a noise good. Last year from Solvang. <laughs> it's like that material, that pretty material. Mm -hmm. Or, you know what I mean? Like your mom Shiny has. Ones, yeah. Your mom has them, dad has them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you need to get a third one. Like, like Maxi, but just <laughs> this way. This way. <laughs> okay, we're gonna try this wine. Cheers to. <laughs> You're like, there's nothing. Cheers to tears. <laughs> Stop. Cheers to you know what, because that was kind of exciting today. That was funny. Uh. Ew. <laughs> no. <laughs> there's your review right there. I cannot. 
That's peppery. <laughs> That's the only word I know how to use. <laughs> Me <it>. too. <laughs> That's all I say. It's peppery. It's like ass. <laughs> you guys. It's like needless to say, my sister, my nephew, Maxie, and I are not sophisticated. <laughs> it's like so strong at the first sip, but then it's like watery. <laughs> I don't know. What? It was not good. <laughs> it wasn't good. It wasn't good. <laughs> hey, you cannot open presents right now. We're going to have to find a different advent calendar next year. <laughs> yeah, like we are not. Chocolates or something. <laughs> chocolates or specifically white wine. Yes. Or tequila. Just like a little bit of tequila. I don't know. You're that, like one you know shot. how when you're going to puke, your mouth starts watering? That's how you feel right now. Whenever someone talks about tequila, that's how my mouth feels. What was the experience that made you feel like that? I mean, just so drunk I puked. Yeah. <laughs> just, yeah, no. It's all yours. Cheers to that. <laughs> Makes editing a little bit easier. No. Oh. Nope. Nope. I felt that one in my nose. Watch it come out. Have you ever done that? Snarfed? No. Like when you laugh and liquid comes out your nose? I think I've done that maybe with like milk or something. I call it snarf. I don't know if that's the right word for it. When Comment I, below if snarf isn't a, oh, an actual term. When I was like 14. Oh God. <laughs> I know dad watches all of these. He's like, where was she at 14? <clears throat> I went to visit my friend in New York. Um, but I was a good girl. I hadn't tried anything at that point. And so in their house, they have a basement. And we took, we took a bottle of vodka from her parents' cabinet, I guess. I don't really remember where we got it. Yeah. And we went into the bathroom in the basement. <clears throat> and we were taking tastes of it. Gross. And... I was, no taking, I was taking a sip and like one of her little siblings, she had a little brother and little sister, one of them came downstairs and then it made me laugh and it, I snarfed it and the vodka came out my oh, nose. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it hurt. <laughs> it taught me a lesson. Mm. No more vodka. So this is going to be a no for us? It's a no for me, dog. It's a no for me, dog. So when you scan it, it gives you more information about the specific wine. <laughs> Does it say what it like pairs with, like mm -hmm. meats and cheeses and stuff? It says, we love drinking this wine with pork and beans, fondue, goat cheese. Pork and beans. <laughs> <laughs> we love drinking, we love drinking this wine with pork and beans. Pork and beans? <laughs> <laughs> Something about Mary. <laughs> You're cracking up. So good about Mary. <laughs> Mary's oh my brother. He's obsessed with pork and beans. <laughs> and then the and then the guy Ben Stiller zips up his pants and and he says the oh, are the beans about the pork or something like that. Ew. I can confidently say that I have never heard a wine taste good with pork and beans <laughs> or mushroom <laughs> chowder <laughs> goat cheese pizza <laughs> little chicky and the girl she's a baby girl yeah 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 it got stuck oh. you know what's stuck all right here they are both assembled um the gemini which is this one has two batteries there is one that slots in here and there's one that slots in back here both of which have keys so you can remove it or you know lock it in there um this one the gemini goes over 27 miles an hour i tested it out today it was quite fast um has also has a different screen as well but the installation the installation instructions on the Gemini versus the Libra, they're very similar, nearly identical. Um, trying to think of anything in particular. 
setup on the headlight was a little different. It was actually on this model. You have a hex nut. This has street tires on it. This seems way more street oriented. And these aren't any like little old street tires. Like you can see my hand is like pretty big, pretty fast. You can also lock in the suspension on this model. So if you're gonna be on the streets for a while, nice smooth, you're gonna lock it in. If you're going off-roading, you're gonna open those bad boys up. Anyway, I'm really excited to take these out. Jane and I are gonna take these up to the Sequoia National Park um, and run around on them for a bit and see how they see how they are. Which one do you guys like better? Very curious. Completely different. Personally, I'm kind of a fan of the Libra because I like having off-road stuff um, and I love having a passenger seat or someone can just sit on there and mob with you. It's always a fun time having a homie with you. And uh, I like the rear suspension on here as well. But on the other hand, Gemini's dope because it's got two batteries and it absolutely, you can, you know, 27 miles an hour is fast on a bicycle. I don't know if you guys have any of you felt how that fast, but I'm sure you've bombed a hill once or twice in your life and you get up there. So pretty stinking sweet, man. Probably strap the toolkits on this one. I don't know. I don't know how we're going to do it, but we're going to do it. 